So you want to know how to prank and you want to do some candy pranks. Well get ready, we're going to go over some right now. So take the peanut butter cup out, open it very carefully. Then you're going to take the peanut butter cup out from the casing and flip it upside down. Take a small razor and cut open a little square. Be careful. And also you want to be careful that your, friend, your friends or family that you're pranking may have a peanut butter allergy or peanut allergy so you do not want to do this to anybody that has an allergic react allergy but take some hot sauce stick it inside put this back on clean that off you want to use the bottom because <clears throat> Nobody really looks at the bottom of the peanut butter cup. So they always just take it out of the wrapper and eat it right away. Then put this back together. Hold it there for a second, let the chocolate melt to back to the wrapper. Some glue. Seal it back to the wrapper. So take your peanut butter cups and give it to a friend. Hey friend. Oh, shit. What's up, Brandon? You want a Reese's cup? Everyone knows I like, uh... Peanut butter cups. <laughs> All right. Come on, man. <laughs> what is in this, man? <laughs> no, nah, man. What the? <laughs> Disgusting, man. <laughs> now we're gonna swap out hot candy with some mints. So take some cinnamon mints, preferably not a popular brand where people won't really recognize this, but it's red, and swap them out with some hot candy. Take the hot candy, put it in here, close it up, and bam, you got it right there. They're gonna think they got some cinnamon mints. They're gonna open it up. They're gonna think it's cinnamon. They're gonna take a bite. And bite. Man, that's some hot cinnamon. Now you wanna melt down some chocolate all the way. Drop in a couple meatballs or you can do whatever you want, however many you want, but for this purpose, I'm just going to do two. Cover the meatballs up nice with this nice milky chocolate. Drop the meatballs on a wax paper. Put the meatballs in the refrigerator so the chocolate can chill. Take out your meatballs. Put your chocolate covered meatballs on a plate. <clears throat> Take some raspberry icing gel. Put it on top for some decoration. I take your chocolate raspberry balls and share them with a friend. Thanks, dude. <laughs> Here's a meatball, dude. Yeah, these things are disgusting, right? Ugh. No, none of this. Shit. None of this, shit, dude. Oh, dude. <laughs> Alright, alright. So bad. Swap sour candy with regular candy. The best ones to get the wrappers that just have candy inside. Take the sour candy. Find one with a similar color. Pop it out. Now we're gonna take this plastic, unwrap it, swap it out with the sour candy. And your friend will be in for a really sour surprise. Next, you're gonna take a jawbreaker and swap it out with a piece of gum. So try and squeeze out this gum nice and carefully. As carefully as possible. There we go, right out the top. So you can put your jawbreaker inside. Boom. Boom. Now it's sealed in there. You can't tell it's been messed with. And when they go in to take their gum, they'll be in for a surprise that it's a jawbreaker. 
Next, you want to peel some garlic. Get three garlic cloves. You can add more if you want. Drop them in the milk chocolate. Stir them up. Get them covered up. Drop them on wax paper. And, uh, and drop them in the fridge. Now take out your garlic covered chocolate. Now you have chocolate covered peanuts. Take your chocolate covered peanuts and share them with a friend. <laughs> oh, Jesus, dude. Alright, can I have the plate in case something happens? Yes. <laughs> what is that? It's garlic. Oh my god. Alright, let's see what these taste like. <laughs> oh, it burns. It Spe burns. Special recipe from Italy. <laughs> Ooh, made my eyes water. Another one of my favorites is taking gum that's supposed to change the color of your mouth to a different color and swapping it with regular gum that people have no idea will change the color of their mouth and tongue. Just, again, carefully open it. Swap it out. And carefully seal it with the lighter using caution and safety. Don't burn your fingers. Boom. Now it's sealed. No one's gonna know the difference when you just hand it off to your friend. Hey man, you want a piece of gum? Yeah, dude, no problem. And then when they chew it, they have no idea that the inside of their mouth, their teeth, and everything is gonna be colored purple. Next, take some caramel, melt that down. Take a red onion, drop it in, and mix it all up. Put the caramel onion in the refrigerator, let it cool down. Now take your caramel apple slash onion. Bring it outside. Now you wanted a red. You want to get a red onion because sometimes you can see through the caramel, but people will think it's a red apple. Serve your caramel onion to somebody. Ugh. God, it's disgusting. That is a stinky one. That's a bad one. Oh, the garlic, chocolate, peanuts, and the onion are the worst. Try these out for Halloween. Try them out for fun with your friends. Enjoy, be safe, and don't forget about those allergies. Anybody allergic to peanuts, you don't want to give them anything with peanut products. Be safe. Happy Halloween. Until next time. What's up? What's up? Happy Halloween. You want to fight Michael Myers? That's a death wish.